guys, welcome back to another video on Dragon City. I gotta say that I'm preparing to finish this Panda Island event. And, you know, hopefully you guys have completed as well. This Panda Island event is really for... It, it's kind of like uh, to support the kind of campaign that Apple WWF as well as Social Point is having on basically bringing awareness to... Um, you know people about the planet essentially but anyways i'm almost done with the panda event let's go on in here you notice that there's about four days left five days actually four days and 20 something hours so you know um it's gonna end in that time frame and you guys should be able to complete it i think they've given us a lot of time and a lot of you know, the, the the amount of stuff you can collect was very fair, was very supportive. Some of the other events I fell back on because I felt like they were just very, very difficult. But this event, this event was good. This event was awesome. This event was just, it's there. Let's just say that. Uh, what we got here is the final, second final dragon, which is the symbiote dragon. Or the symbiotic dragon. <laughs> All right. Anyways, um, fresh water provides water for drinking. Yes. All right. Agriculture, transport, electricity, generation, and recreation. It is also a major habitat for species such as this dragon. Okay. Oh my God! It's a legendary dragon. Oh wow, that's something I didn't notice. I'm like, I'm falling asleep. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, I see it's a legendary dragon. So it's not only a legendary rarity dragon, it also has the legendary element. That's what they used to call it, the legendary element. But now, I don't know, they changed the name a bit. Well, they changed the legendary dragon to legacy dragon. So that's kind of strange. If that is, a, oh wow, we got two legendary dragons. That's awesome. Or we're going to get two legendary dragons. So here's the first one. And this thing has like a goldfish on its back. And I I think it's amazing. Let me just go on over here. We're going to swipe on a bit and try to get this dragon into our game. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, so here is no. All right, so here's the dragon. My bad. I, I was, whoops. I thought that was like the, the frost dragon or something. 16, 17 hours, 7 gems to speed up. It has this tidal wave kind of look. Or I guess they, it was the dragon's whisker, right? I don't know. I mean, I could be entirely wrong. That's what it looks like to me. Um, it looked like that was what it was. <laughs> I don't know. I could be wrong. And, you know, usually I am wrong. But anyways, there it is. And it looks like it has three little bubbles that's hanging on top of it as well, which is something I don't see a lot. All right, so we're going to go in here, and what we're going to do is we are going to fast it forward. Oh, right. I didn't go over the elements. Uh, well, yeah, elements. All right, legendary, water, and plant. Here's the baby form. Let's put the dragon into our game, but I need to find a habitat. Is there a better habitat other than those two habitats? Alright, so let's put it into this habitat. Ta-da! Number 530. Highly recommend that you get this dragon for your game if you haven't gotten it. Like I was saying, it's easy to play. Not too difficult. And, you know, just highly recommended. Alright, so here is the dragon. Get, get out there a bit and go on in here. There's the baby form. Essentially, what this dragon does is that it goes into hiding. I think that's what it's doing anyways. It looks like it kind of... I don't know. I guess it, it gets scared and then it goes... It turns into a shell. Well, not a shell. I don't know what it's doing. I gotta say, I think it's a turtle. Except there's... I think... Okay. What I see with this dragon right now, I'm a bit confused about it. I'm looking at it. I'm like sitting there. What in the world is this? It looks like a turtle with a shell. And, you know, the shell is really the bubble or the, the circle there. That's what it looks like to me. I mean, the, you know, I don't know. What, let me know what you think in the comments below. But personally to me, it looks like the shell, the, the thing is the shell. And then he hides in the shell. And then the leg is gone. 
Yeah, that's what it looks like. All right, anyways, <laughs> I'm not gonna talk too much about it. Let's feed it off a bit. We're gonna get it into second form. Maybe we can see a bit more about the dragon. So here it is. Yes, I knew it. I knew it. And I didn't. I didn't see the animation. If it was there earlier, I missed it. But gosh, there it is. And I was right. It is a sort of turtle. That's what it looks like. I thought it was a turtle, and it definitely is a turtle. No doubt about it. I don't have a doubt in my mind that it's not a turtle. But anyways, so it is a turtle kind of dragon. It has these. It looks like it has a bunch of these swirl. I'm not so like I'm not sure what those swirls represent, but there's a lot of them going on. I, I don't know. It's just there, I, I guess. We are going to... Alright, let's go feed the dragon a bit more. It looks like the second animation and the first animation is very similar, right? It hides in the shell, but the only thing that's different is now you get to see the shell. So that's the, that's the main difference. Alright, what we're going to do is we're going to feed it a bit more. Get it into its final form. Ta-da! And the final form is you get this to see a goldfish. Oh, I guess that's the final form. You get to see a goldfish. Let's see. Oh, so it's still, it's still doing the same thing. I was thinking, hey, maybe there would be a an new animation. But it still has the same thing. It does pretty much. It hides in the shell um, most of the time. It sticks its head into the shell, and that's basically it. I was thinking, hey, maybe there would be something different. But I don't know. It doesn't look like there's too much of a difference there. I mean, you could always let me know if there is to you. But there's a goldfish, and inside the goldfish thingy, the circle bubble thingy, is a castle, a sand-made castle. That's what it looks like to me. What else do I see? His body's definitely gotten a lot bigger. There's a lot of waves. In <laughs> I, I'm just making up names. There's like, you know, the whiskers and the th the the symbols. There's just a lot of wave-looking thing. It looks like sea waves. But anyways, here it is. We're going to feed it up some more. We're going to get it to level 15, 17, 18, or 19 to take a look at his attack. And at this point in time, I want to ask everybody to, you know, that hasn't liked the video to like give a little support to not only Dragon City, but for this video as well. If you guys have already done that, that's super duper amazing. I want to thank you guys so much. And, you know, also at the same time, I want to ask, like in every video, usually nowadays I ask, what do you think the battle attack is going to be? Because I want to take a look at the battle attack. And before that, I'm going to ask everybody to guess what the battle attack is. You always let me know what it is. Before battling, you can always, you know, tweet me on Twitter or comment in the comment section below. But right now... We're going to look at the battle attack, and hopefully you guys have made your guess to what do you think the battle attack is going to be. Now, I am going to make my guess, and hopefully I get it right. You know, so sometimes I, you know, the last video, I actually thought about a bubble blast kind of thing, but I didn't say anything because, I don't know, I just, this one, let me guess this one. Oh, I don't think that he's going to attack with the goldfish. Do you think that's possible? I think he's just going to roar. That's what I would think. Because, I, you know, I don't think he's going to attack with the goldfish. That's not possible. It's not that it's not possible. It's just too much work, probably. I don't know. I mean, that's my guess. What is your guess? Let me know in the comments. And we're going to check it out Well, after this. So he has the sword, legend spell, acid rain, beehive. We should train legend spell. I like that spell. Uh, actually, maybe we'll do it later. Alright, so this is a pretty cool dragon. We're going to check out the attack now. Three, two, one, go! Oh, bubble blast! Oh my gosh! Reminds me of Squirrel. You know, that's nice. That's nice. That's Even though it's similar to the last dragon's attack, which is a deep sea dragon, at least it did some sort of attack. Well, some sort of animation and that's something i definitely like unfortunately i thought they were get it would, you know i thought they were gonna do anything but anyways if you guys guessed uh that he was gonna do a bubble blast that would be that is super duper amazing you guys are awesome can't believe you gotten it right <laughs> you know i can't believe i did guess that i you know in somewhere in the back of my mind i i, I was just thinking gosh they're probably not gonna do that since the deep sea dragon was doing something very similar but they did so i was wrong anyways 
that's pretty much it for this video. Again, you can only get this dragon through the special panda island. If you haven't gone into the special panda island, I highly recommend that you do. Really cool island and really easy to play, in fact. And it's probably one of the easiest islands to play in the game ever that I've seen so far in these past three years. So definitely highly recommended the pa Panda Island. And again, is this island is there in support of WWF, as you can see. So, you know, apps for the Earth, supporting the Earth. You can learn more about it. But anyways, that is about it for this video. That is the Dragon in Dragon City. And we'll be back in the next video as we check out the last dragon in the game.